And new at six, investigators tell us they have identified the vandal who slashed a $3 million painting in Aspen. We first reported on that crime last summer after a surveillance camera at the Opera Gallery recorded the shocking incident. Well, Mountain Newsroom reporter Matt Croshaw shows us this investigation has now gone international. It's the mystery of the year. Who was behind the disguise responsible for slashing that multi-million dollar painting? Well, police in Aspen have been on the case for months and their clues have led them overseas. Video from inside this high-end art gallery captured the attack and the person responsible. Now, Aspen police say they have a prime suspect in the case. This is an international case and um, so we wouldn't look at an international extradition of a suspect, for example, without having more of an airtight case. Months of records and warrants and the good old-fashioned police work leading to an unnamed suspect. The, the problem with this case is it's, it's complex. It's not the sort of thing that we deal with on the average day. The original work valued at nearly $3 million. No insurance claims ever filed, but police still believe yes. there was a financial motive behind the strange knife attack. They have turned to online clues to help solve the strange case. Where the old gumshoe is walking the beat and walking door to door, knocking on doors, we're still doing the same sort of thing, but it's like knocking on the door of Google and Facebook and Apple and, and asking them the questions that we used to ask of neighbors and it just takes a lot longer. As work continues, police in Aspen are confident this won't turn into a cold case. I think we will successfully bring this case to a close. The attorney for the owner of the painting tells us that they have made those repairs. It's not clear if that original artwork is back on the market. Reporting in Aspen, Matt Kroschel covering Colorado first.